everybody, welcome back to the show floor of NAM 2007, Winter NAM 2007 in sunny Anaheim, California. Why do they have the winter show in the sunny area? I don't know. But we're here with the uh, with uh, Karsten from Solemony, and we're going to be talking about the Melodyne plug-in. Uh, Melodyne, of course, is a, uh, a, a pretty well-known and very powerful uh, pitch correction uh, software product that has been a standalone product for, the, uh, for several years. And just uh, this, uh, in late 2006, uh, uh, Melodyne was released as a VST uh, plug-in. So let's talk a little bit about that. Okay. Yep. We can talk about the plug-in. Yeah. What's uh, what? 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 Why did you uh, go to a VST uh, platform? Yeah. Well, the, the main thing to, to do it as a plug-in was uh, the user requests. So people don't want to leave their host application to do things, and so and Melodyne is a huge application which can do 100,000 of things. So we had to cut down it a little bit to make it yeah working within a plug-in because in a plug-in you have certain limitations and so and. Uh, yeah, on the other hand, we said we saw that people want to use to have a tool just to correct and fix some things. Yeah, and for that application, for fixing your vocals and for correct timings and these things, the plugin is a very, very good thing. So we cut it down to the plugin, but it took a while to make it working. And also, the host applications have to develop to a certain yeah technical level to make things like we want to have to do working. So we ask all these guys, and they did it for us. And so now is the time to have a plugin working on on the world. So. What was your biggest challenge in working with the uh, software development kit for, that Steinberg publishes? Um, well, the biggest challenge with that one is that you have a couple of hosts. Yeah, so uh, you have uh, we're supporting VST and Audio Unit and RTS, and there are many many hosts out, and you have to make it working in every host application. Yeah, and uh, we've spent a lot of time and development efforts and testing to make it working on every machine best, so without crashing and these these stuff. Yeah. And on the other hand, we had to develop a few things about the user interface I can show you later uh, yeah, to make it uh, usable for the user, to make it comfortable. So. Very good. Well, let's take a close look at the uh, VST uh, from uh, Melodyne, okay. or the Melodyne VST, rather. So, um, if you had a, a logic arrangement like this one here, uh, with that vocal track over there, we can listen to that one. And you wanted to uh, do some editings on that vocal thing here. You can instantiate the plugin on that track. And um, before you can uh, work with the Melodyne capabilities on that audio file, Melodyne has to understand what's going on musically on that track. So you have to once play, play back the track to show it up to Melodyne, uh, which works like this here. So once we did that, the plugin shows up our audio stuff here within the usual notes. You see the, the scale you're working in and these things. And um, well, I'd like to show you what uh, you can do with the Melodyne technology if you don't know about that already. So. So you're very free in editing the timing and the pitch. And for the everyday work, we have a couple of macros like this correct pitch macro here, uh, where you simply choose how much you want to like to correct your stuff and hit OK, and uh, or use uh, the quantize panel here for correct your timing things with one click, and you have fixed everything up. So at a very high, very high sound quality. So that's basically what it is about. So we have this very nice sliders here which show where audio is, so if you go over that side and don't know, oh, I don't know where the things really are, scroll over to that location, yeah, and you immediately go what, what you have. And you can resize the uh, window size of the plugin, so if you have a 30-inch cinema display, make your plugin 30-inch, yeah, so you don't have to f fiddle around in the small things and all these things.